what's up guys welcome back to another video if you haven't already please subscribe to the channel like I always say um, so today we're gonna be working on my trailer I'm gonna be changing my brakes but I'm gonna be using a tool that um, I used before on this trailer but I never recorded it but um, I tested it um, about a year ago and today I'm gonna be changing one side um, my back brake so I'm gonna be using this tool let me turn my camera around so this is the labor saving wrench so this wrench right here this stuff right here is the real deal it's very unique and it saved time and it's very powerful believe it or not um, this actually can take off all of these lug nuts without any power tool all you got to do is just put it on and start turning so let me pop this open there it is comes with a manual comes with all the sockets and all the extensions so as you can see it's a little bit scuffed up because I used it before um, but today we're going to be using this we're going to be using this to take off all these lug, lug nuts because I got to take these these tires off so I could change the brakes on this trailer so uh let me show you how to operate this i'm going to take off one lug nut and show you guys that this little thing that looks simple can indeed take all these lug nuts off so let me put this together what, it, what i'm going to do is um i'm going to take this right here okay and um i'm going to take a socket this socket right here fit these lug nut right here this is a uh, 33 millimeter so I'm gonna put the socket at the end here All right like so and this handle right here I'm gonna take this handle and I'm gonna put it at the end of this like so and then I'm gonna put that this on the lug nut and all I gotta do is just start to turn the handle. All right, it's the same direction as you would um, take off um, a regular, you know, as you would use like a regular power tool to take off the lug nuts. All right, so let me set my camera up and show you guys how to take off one of these. All right, so I'm gonna put on my 33 millimeter on this lug nut right here. This is the one I'm gonna take off, but on the bottom, I'm going to put another um, socket right here in the bottom just for some, some, some uh, support because this piece right here I'm going to have to rest on this lug nut but once I start turning it's going to slip off a little bit and I don't want it to damage the threads so I'm going to put this lug nut I mean this socket right here on this lug nut and then uh, I'm going to put my tools on my tool on right here Like so, I'm gonna put the handle on and I'm gonna start to turn. Don't forget to show the channel some love by subscribing feels loose already guys I could use one hand let me bring you guys closer and show you that it is turning Oops. so take a look at the, the socket you see that it's turning see that It is coming loose. Right now, I could use one finger. See that? 
All right, so look like we broke that one loose. So let's take this off. Look at that, guys. <laughs> look at that. I should have used my finger to show you guys that it was um, tightened because I know some people are very skeptical. So, since I didn't do that, I'm going to I'm going to uh, take off another one just to show you guys that this tool right here is a bad mother. Shut your mouth. All right. So see that it's off. Now let's do, you can see guys, nothing been on here. I'm just trying to prove to you guys that this thing works like a charm. You can tell that all these, all these are have dirt and rust on it. You, you see no evidence that, like no tools, no socket was on them recently. All right, so I'm gonna put this socket on here. And the bottom lug nut right here, I'm gonna put an extra socket on there just to get some support um, when this one, when this piece go on there. So I'm gonna put this socket right here in the bottom lug nut. And um, I'm gonna put the tool I'm gonna put the tool like so. Then I'm gonna put on the handle. And I'm gonna start to turn. It is moving slowly, guys. I could feel my hand getting looser and looser. That mean it's coming off. Let me bring the camera closer so you guys can see that the socket is spinning, it's moving. See that? Yep, I can feel my hand is loose right now. See that? So I think it's, I think it's off. Let's take this off, put it there, and take this off. It's a little bit, it's still tight. Let's put it back on guys. And let's put it back on and go at it again. Let's set this camera up here. Yeah, I think that's it. I think we got it now. Yep, we got it. So at this point, if you have like a another regular power battery operated wrench, if you want, you could just break it loose with this and then use your wrench and just bust this open. As you can see, it's loose. See that? But I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it back on there and um, finish taking it off. I'm just gonna use this to get it off of it. It's not that, it's not too far from coming off, so might as well just put this back on there and get it off with it. Should be able to come off now with, with by hand. 
So here's another tool here. This piece right here, guys. This one was in the case too. So you can attach these two and you can, this is like a quick release. So you can put it right here. I don't know if you guys are seeing this, but let me move this camera. So this extension right here, this extension, you can uh, put it in here. And then the handle, you can put a handle here and you start turning it by hand. It's like a quick, quick release. So you start turning, just like that. And came right off. That's it. So in total, we took two of them off. We took this one off. So we took this one off and we took this one off. So I'm gonna finish taking off all of these. Um, but I just wanna show you guys how to use this tool right here. So I'm, I'm probably gonna make a separate video on just how to use this tool right here to take off your lug nut. Then I make another video separately and show you guys how to um, how to change your brakes on a semi truck, particularly this trailer right here. This is a Wabash trailer. But anyway, um, that's it for this video, guys. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video.